Hello everyone, it's Muriel. I'm here with a card share that I want to show you I made this weekend. I uh, went to a crop on Sunday. It was from 10 o'clock to 8 o'clock. A friend of mine in the crafting community was hosting it and she was hosting it at a firehouse which was really cool. It was this huge room full of uh, five foot tables. Everyone had a table for themselves. And I totally um, double booked myself because I also had a birthday party to go to that afternoon at 3.30. So I got there at 10 at the scrapbook crop and I stayed till 2. And in that time I got these cards done that I want to share with you. And I used the paper pad I just purchased, the Heidi Swap, um, at Michael's. So really quick let me show you because these, uh, all the flowers that I used on these cards are from Craft Supplies 1. And I want to let you ladies know that Craft Supplies 1 is having a huge sale. It starts today, March 18th through April 1st. And everything is 20% off. No coupon needed. Now that would include your beads, your trims, your flowers. And once it's gone, then it's gone. So I would certainly hop over now, see what you can get, take advantage of the 20% off, and just have fun buying some of these uh, wonderful products that Julie is selling that I want to show you tonight. So I used uh, many of the white roses that came in my design team package for this card here. Um, the paper again is from the Heidi Swap collection and this beautiful music sheet paper I purchased at a local scrapbook store. She sells them six sheets for a dollar. They're, um, excuse me, um, six by six sheets of music note paper. So I pulled those out to use on this card. And this butterfly is from Close to My Heart. They come in a pack of various um, sizes. I believe they're called uh, Flutter. So if you are a uh, Close to My Heart follower, these uh, came out maybe last year. And they're just different sizes of uh, butterflies. Plain, some with music notes and some with just some book words, you know, book notebook words on them. So um, here's the first card here. There is some lace here from Craft Supplies 1, a uh, button from my stash, and then I use my Martha Stewart punch to punch out a couple of these leaves in just some white cardstock to mimic the white flowers. And on the flowers, the roses um, are stickles. Here is some bling trim that I have for my stash as well. And then this is a chipboard from Close to My Heart with a sticker that says Smile. And then on the inside, I just finished it off with a pocket page from the um, paper pad and just used one of the cards and cut them out. So my sentiment will write, be written on that white part. And then just another tag here that says Sweet. I love these colors. I love this paper pad. The second one, same thing. The uh, message here is Sharing. Again, those beautiful white roses from uh, Craft Supplies 1 with the leaves. They all have stickles on them. And then this white trim, again, from Craft Supplies 1. And on the inside, I finished this one off like this. Again, you would just pull out one of those tags. It has Remember on the bottom. You can write your sentiment tuck it back in. So here are two more that I did. Um, this beautiful, soft, white um, lace is uh, from a D-stash I got from uh, Marissa over at Creative Young Mama. And uh, the paper was so easy to work with because you could just cut off a section of it that had a wording or a design on it and just kind of go from there. So these flowers here, Craft Supplies 1, this beautiful pink one, green one, and then that is one of the diamonds that they sell as well, like a bauble. Very, very pretty. And here's a button for my stash, and then one of the tags from the paper pad, as well as this border strip here of this animal print. And then on the inside, I finished it off just using a Tim Holtz a die, and I can write my sentiment there. I love this lace. It's so, so pretty and so soft. And then the um, other card is here, where I use some more of that lace. And this beautiful black loopy trim. I believe I bought from MB um, Treasurista. Again, there's the flowers from Craft Supplies 1. And um, just one of the um, die cut stickers from the collection. 
and I cut out the banner and then some letters that spelled out happy and then used a um, sticker here that said birthday and that was on the tag it says beautiful here is a stick pin from the uh, mini that I made a couple weekends ago this is from some beads that were given to me by Darla G thank you so much and you can see underneath here I layered some of that animal print paper and just curled that over I've seen Laura do that many a times and um, it just adds a different look to the card and on the inside I finished it off Oh, this one is sideways no wonders I'm having trouble so I just used some of the paper uh, one of the corners that came on the sheet and then one of the cutouts okay the fifth one here again some of the paper um, I layered three buttons down here and use some of this beautiful beige lace trim there is a border underneath it from the paper pad you can see this the green and white polka dot and then I use some of my crinkle shabby ribbon here with two flat back pearls and then um, there is a uh, rolled uh, flower there made with some book paper and some Martha Stewart leaf right there on the side and then I used a sticker that said here's to us on top of a white chipboard and then you recognize this is from Michael those chipboard pieces and what I did here was I just rubbed some of this snow text on top of it this good stuff here I got at Hobby Lobby one of the uh, youtubers uh, emailed me that uh, name of it and uh, she puts it on her flowers and certainly you can put it on anything but I just wanted to bring attention to the beautiful design on that chipboard piece and then on the inside is just some paper with some of the animal print at the bottom and then the last one uh, some of the paper that had the word remember here again three buttons now these buttons here are uh, from uh, Lisi Elise, excuse me. Elise had given me these buttons and they are just the go-to Elise. And one day they're going to be all gone, but in the meantime I am using the world out of them. Thank you so much. Some more of the green um, shabby wrinkled uh, ribbon and then another um, rolled book flower. And then the chipboard piece here is of a crown. Again, I just rubbed some of the snow text on top. And then this is one of those sentiments from making memories this says friends for life so I just wanted kind of a different you know not so happy birthday not so thank you just some different ones sometimes I want to say something totally different when I send a card to someone and the inside is just finished off with some of the um, paper so here is the um, paper pad which I showed you a couple of days ago so if you're heading over to Michael's I don't know if Joanne has it but it is the Heidi Swap uh, 54 sheets of treated and there are about six pages of accessory pages meaning they have tags and banners and lots of cutouts that you can use you can see I've been really just whacking away at it so get on over and uh, if you like this paper pad go ahead and purchase it if you like the cards the flowers that I used again craft supplies one on Etsy 20% off on both of her stores. One is on Etsy, one is on uh, Zibit. So all the all the merchandise is 20% off, and uh, it's going to be like that through April 1st until supplies last. So ladies, thank you again, and thank you for my new subbies. I've had several this week. I am really trying to uh, get onto your channel so I can go ahead and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching my channel. I hope that I am bringing you things that are encouraging you to get in your craft room and create. So have a good evening, and bye for now.